We Brits don't celebrate Thanksgiving, but we will watch a Thanksgiving-themed slasher and critique it accordingly. And when it comes to slasher films for me, they're either surprisingly enjoyable or dog shit. There's no other spectrum that they fall on. And where does Thanksgiving land? Surprisingly, really fun. Like, I'm actually surprised at how much I enjoyed this film because it's a fairly simple, straightforward film. With slashes, I don't need a deep plot. I don't need themes and emotions that are going to resonate forever. I mean, if you can give me that, that's always a bonus, but I don't need that. As long as it's enjoyable and gory and fun and not cringy and overreaching. If you can tick all of those boxes and just execute it well, then that's fine by me for a slasher. And Thanksgiving ticks all those boxes and executes it really well. And it's also got a really good blend of campiness and also some genuine tension and suspense. Because campiness is another very tricky thing for me, especially when it comes to horror films, because a lot of the time I feel like it just kind of robs potential tension and scares away from whatever they're trying to do. And in the case of this film, it just works wonders because you have both characters giving naturally funny reactions to the horrible things that are happening and when people are just being stupid, but also in terms of the deaths as well, which are very, very gory. I was actually not prepared for the goriness. It's rated 18 in the UK. Yep, it earns an 18 rating. Also, surprisingly, I didn't guess who the killer was. There's a whole whodunit element in terms of who's the killer, why they're doing it, what's their motive, yada, yada, yada. And I didn't guess who it was. I don't know if I'm thick or stupid, but when the reveal happened, I was like, wow. Okay, cool, surprise. But I do think the ending was quite rushed. You find out who the killer is, there's a bit of a skirmish, and then in no time, it just rushes to end credits. And it does set up for a sequel, which I'm not surprised about. And I'm just preparing myself for the inevitable cavalcade of Thanksgiving sequels, which are probably going to be forced and completely unearned. Hollywood being Hollywood, once again, with a successful horror film. I went into Thanksgiving with a bit of a shrug, thinking, all right, we'll just see how this goes. Turns out it's one of the most well-made and enjoyable slashes I've seen in quite a long time.